Hey guys, this is Tech It Out, and today I'm going to be doing a quick review of iOS 10 in 2022, and we will be finding out, is it still usable? So let's get started. So for those of you that don't know, iOS 10 is about five years old now. It came out with the iPhone 7 back in 2016. So let's go ahead and um, see how compatible it is with modern applications and websites in 2022. Okay, so just to show you, it is indeed on iOS 10.2 here. And uh, I really just like the old design of iOS 10. You've got the old control center. Um, it was just very different from the current uh, design which uh, actually changed in iOS 11. So let's go ahead and uh, test out like the App Store and just see about app compatibility. Okay so let's just get a basic game here or two. Now let's go ahead and get a couple social media apps like YouTube and Instagram. So YouTube you have to download a older version but it will still download. Let's check on Instagram. Same with Instagram, you gotta download an older version. But anyways, let's just go ahead and uh, see how they work. Okay, so all three apps are downloaded. Uh, Minecraft was actually the only app that was able to download the latest version, but uh, YouTube and Instagram were older versions, but they should still work, as we will find out here in just a minute. But let's go ahead and test out Minecraft, which is the only video game that we'll be testing today, just to uh, keep this video short. Okay, so I've just been fighting with Minecraft here for a bit, and it just gets stuck on this loading screen every single time. I've tried uh, different Wi-Fi networks, everything, and it's it's not the Wi-Fi network, so that's unfortunate. Uh, so I guess Minecraft, even though it is the latest version, it does not work on iOS 10. Um, I'm sure there's another game that we can try just to uh, see, like, uh, what's a popular game? Let's get Clash Royale and just see... Um, if it will download and if it will play. Okay, so that does download the latest version, it seems. Um, okay, but first let's go ahead and uh, test out Instagram, even though this is not the latest version. Uh, okay, it does seem that it does work just fine. Uh, posts are loading up. I can see my account just fine here. I actually just posted my first reel today. Um, never posted one before. So, yep. Instagram works fine. Let's go ahead and test out YouTube. Uh, okay, well, I guess that doesn't work, but it will take you to Safari. So let's just see how YouTube on Safari works. Okay, so it uh, it seems like it's going to work just fine. Hey guys, this is Tech It Out, and today we're going to be yeah, full screen mode works. You just can't get the uh, so YouTube we'll app itself to work, which is unfortunate because it's really convenient when you actually have the app. Okay, so let's go ahead and test out Clash Royale. This will be the last app that we test uh, since Minecraft didn't load, which is unfortunate. I really thought it would. This is actually the first device ever in a video that I've ever filmed that Minecraft has failed to work entirely. So, uh, so yeah, I've never had this happen. Okay, so it seems like Clash Royale works. I'm not very good at this. Um, just FYI. Seems like it's gonna work. It's fine. Uh, I'm gonna die though. It's not even worth trying. Anyways, this proves my point. Um, Clash Royale works just fine. So far though, app compatibility is not the best. Um, the only things that were able to download the latest version was Clash Royale and Minecraft, but uh, the social media apps did not download the latest version at all. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, test out Safari. We already did a little brief testing of uh, YouTube.com, but let's just go ahead and test another website just to uh, make sure that it's not super glitchy. And uh, you can see it is taking a little bit to, to load everything. None of the images have loaded up, 
but the website itself has. Okay, so I, uh, I tried refreshing and still nothing on the home page, but let's just go to a different page and see what happens. Okay, so now we have some images here on the iPhone page. Um, I think it's working correctly as far as I can tell, but there could be some little transitions. Let's just go ahead and uh, go to another page. Let's go to the Mac page. Uh, everything's loaded up. Man, I'm excited about the Mac Studio. But here you can see some weird glitch going on. I'm not sure what that is. Uh, so seems that iOS 10 Safari is a little bit out of date. Um, but I think if you had to use it, you could definitely make do um, because it hasn't just straight up crashed. Now let's just go to Amazon.com. Man, typing on this small screen is hard. So you can already see, uh, okay, it loaded there, but uh, you can already just see that it takes a second to load some of the stuff. Um, and it's not necessarily in the best quality, but uh, it seems like it's loading. It just takes it a minute. Try refreshing, still nothing. So you can't see the images on Amazon, which is uh, a bit strange, but at least uh, you can see the title, right? Like if you wanna buy an iPhone 13 mini, here we go. Okay, so let's go ahead and test out iMessage. So this is a bit of a weird situation. They're actually both on the same account because I couldn't get it to connect to my phone number, which I usually do through iCloud. So as you can see here, even though it's a bit of a weird situation and they're on the same iCloud account, uh, even though they're technically texting themselves, iMessage does work on iOS 10. Okay, so now we're going to see if FaceTime works on iOS 10. So uh, let's just go ahead and call and see if it works. To be honest, I'm quite surprised that this works since they're both on the same iCloud account. You can see here, FaceTime works perfectly fine on iOS 10. Even though we've had a bit of trouble with app compatibility and Safari's web browsing compatibility, um, I can assure you that all the stock applications like FaceTime, Messages, Phone, and Mail will work perfectly fine if you want to use iOS 10. However, would I recommend using iOS 10 in 2022? Absolutely not, simply because uh, you cannot download the latest versions of apps and Safari is a bit slow and glitchy. However, this video was fun, so if you want to see more videos like these, go ahead and drop a like and subscribe to my channel. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down in the comments below and I'll try to get to them as soon as I can. I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.